It's a fun time of year for a lot of major league teams at their spring training complexes because they have a fantasy camp events. And I, I think just about every team in the big leagues has some version of this or has had one. It's cool. You ever been? Um, no. I've, I've never, never been, been, as, been a, as a camper. But, I know, I, you know, I know that they're a lot of fun, and the guys that go down as campers really enjoy it. They enjoy the storytelling and the chalk talk stuff just as much as they enjoy being on the field. The Padres have had one for years, and it's a nice roll call of celebrity instructors who are down there in Peoria. Next winter, we're sending you to a fantasy camp. Oh, I'd be a blast. Oh, that's, that's I would love it. Done. And so the, these guys, you know, the campers – they pay to do this. It's, you know, they want to go and they get up early and they, you know, some of them get beat up a little bit because they're out there working. Uh, so I, I'll ask aloud, if you're a fan of the Padres or any team, would you pay to go get pitching instruction from a guy like, oh, it's Mark Grant. Wait a minute. We thought we were going to show your snap video. We'll get to that in a minute. Retired right-hander. What are you doing, Mudcat? Good morning, guys. From Peoria, Arizona, Padres Fantasy Camp. You know, it's a, I look back at my career. My career was a fantasy camp, but they paid me. <laughs> uh, it's fun. It's a lot of fun. And, Harold, I don't know if, if you've ever uh, taken part in a fantasy camp, but great guys, lasting relationships, going out there. We see a lot of pulled hammies. We had a guy who was 78 years old yesterday pitch four innings. Come on. 78? Okay. We've got a father-son combination here from San Diego. 78-year-old father and his son, who's a shortstop, pretty good little athlete, and it was just so cool to see him out there pitching and playing uh, on the same team. It's just a lot of fun. And like Maddie said, you know, the stories, you know, we've got Trevor Hoffman here, we've got Randy Jones, Carlos Hernandez, uh, Heath Bell, Wally Joyner, um, Larry Rothschild is here today. We were just in the coach's office telling some stories and talking ball, so it's a lot of fun. It's great. Hey, my, my goal next year... Mark is to get Matt to fantasy camp. How would he measure up? You spent a lot of time around him. You guys are well, close. How would he measure? Well, first, I would love to throw BP to Matty V, first of all, because the first one's going right in the ribs. <laughs> and, no, no, you know what I would do? I would make him feel good early. I would throw it nice and easy, have him get but first he would jam himself. His hands would be so swollen at the end of a BP <laughs> session. <laughs> his his thumbs would be barking. But um he he, you know, the old baseball phrase, and this applies to Matt and Harold, you know what I'm talking about. Matty V couldn't hit water if he fell out of a boat. True. Right? True. True. So, but it would, it would be fun. I think everybody, if you get a chance, you should experience a fantasy camp. Seeing the old pros and stuff like that, um, like I'm, I'm teamed up with Freddie Kendall. Freddie Kendall was uh, a Padre in 1969. He was an original Padre. So hearing stories from the 60s and 70s. And then, you know, Trevor Hoffman, the Hall of Famer, is here hearing stories when he was playing. Wally Joyner. Uh, it's just great. So, so how, many, whole- how many campers are there? How many guys are there? Okay. Yeah, we've got uh, a smaller camp. We've got three teams of 12. So we're kind of doing a little round robin. And uh, I've been to camps before to where we've had as many as 100 campers. Um, it, it's good to have a lot of campers, but it's – it's pretty good to have a low number two because it's a little bit more intimate and you get to know the guys a little bit more one-on-one. I I would imagine, like, the one thing, if you're a Padres fan and you go to Padres Fantasy Camp, and if Trevor's able to, if he's able to still get out there and stretch it out, like, I'd want to dig in there against his changeup. I'd want to see it with my own eyes as a fan. Does he do that? Yeah, he's he's been out there on the mound, and last year he was here, and he got out of the mound and threw some. I don't know if he's done that this year yet. But uh, a lot of people, just being in the presence of Trevor Hoffman is just the, the worth uh, the camp for the, for these campers. So I mean, that's how but, cool is that? You're uh, digging in true. against yeah. the, one of the best yeah. pitchers and pitch as singularly in the yeah. history of the game. Hey, so, so yeah. Mutter, what, what uniform does everybody clamor to? I see you got the brown on today, <laughs> yeah. but what do most yeah, of the campers that. want? Okay, we've got two sets of uh, uniforms, Harold. We've got this one being the away. Uh, this is going to be the brown. I think this is going to be the BP jersey this year for the Padres. Uh, don't quote me on that, but I think that's uh, what the case is. And then also, in honor of uh, in tribute to Randy Jones, uh, the, the Padre Hall of Famer, Cy Young Award winner, 1976, we're wearing the Padres. Um, 76. Should I? Should I? You know, I might lose the connection if I. Uh, that's right. We'll, we'll roll the dice. We've you, done- you want me to go to the coach's office? Yeah. Let's see All who's right, in there. Me- all right, let me see. Hey, I'm walking uh, down guys, the ball. Our, our is control, this a Rex Hudler uh, moment? Hey, freaking out right now. You know, last hey, guys, time we did this, Mutter, it was Rex. It was a Rex Hudler moment. Hey guys, 
clean it up a little bit. Who's in here? <laughs> what could oh, go Heath, wrong here? Live Heath TV. Bell. Heath, put on your T-shirt. Uh, here's Heath Bell. You're on MLB Network. Hey, guys. How are you What's up, Heath? Hey, how you look, doing, man? You look okay. You look good. Basic camp for best thing in the world. You should come out. You look good, man. Hey, Heater, you look better than you did when you played. Hey, oh, look, definitely, definitely do. Hey, look who's here, a Hall of Famer. Hey, guys. Hall of Trev. Good to see you. Got Coffee's of, got the ninth. Hey, hey couple Trevor. Good right here. Hey, Heater, Heater brought his chicken with him. <laughs> <laughs> hey, here's, here, here's the other jersey we're wearing. Oh, the Cy uh, Young. That's cool. That is then, a sweet uh, uni. Here's uh, here's Freddie Kendall, original Padre, 19 year on MLB Network. So, how you doing? What's up, Fred? Fred? Hey, Fred? It's about time we had you on this network. Father of Jason Kendall, of course, a, a gamer and yeah, catcher th that I love. Thanks, Mark. Yeah. We're, we're aware. Thank you very much thanks. for the bio. Oh, okay. Okay. For okay. Appreciate that. All right, uh, baseball encyclopedia. <laughs> hey, where's uh, Trevor yeah. at? Hold on, where's Trevor? We Trevor. Got, we got to ask Trevor. Trevor. He's got to pitch to some of these people. This He's is putting him on back. the spot. But uh, Heater, what, four-time All-Star? Yeah, three-time. Three-time three -time. Uh, I hey, just gave him another All-Star. Why didn't there. I get one vote in the Hall of Fame? Come yeah. On. yeah I know. Just one, oh, one, just one vote. Andy Yeager get... was going to have a party if I got one vote. Didn't you hear about that? I didn't. If we'd known that, we could have bought a vote we, for we, you we somewhere. Have, Everybody in San Diego knew. Now that we don't get a party. There was an extra <laughs> one that Jeter didn't use. We could have got to that one. Okay. Hey. <laughs> hey, tell Jeter to give me that vote. Trevor, we'll there was a party. Pop. Here's Trevor. What'd you want to ask Trevor? Hey, Trevor. Sorry. Trev, yes. so um, a lot of the campers want to face you. We want to know, are you going to crank it up for them and throw a little bit? <laughs> I'll crank up my 73 for them. I'll get them. <laughs> they don't know what's coming. They're going to take them here. down. Carlos Hernandez. Hey, hey, reenact the last out in Atlanta, winning the 1998 pennant. Remember, you guys hug, hug, hug one another. And a fly ball to Finley. <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> Add 100 pounds. Uh, <laughs> pound each. By the way, I apologize to everybody watching on TV because TV adds 100 pounds. So this head of mine. So this head of mine. Don't worry. Don't pounds, worry. I got, the, Trevor, the, I got Trevor's hat on. The brown is red. Look at it. Look at my hat, Trevor. The brown is really slimming, though, mud. It's all right. Oh, my God. Oh. <laughs> Oh, yeah, it's not going to be. Head. It's not going to be any hand. fun at Padres uh, Fantasy Camp, right? <laughs> oh my no, God. no fun at all down there. I'm telling you, the Look subscriptions are flying in, man. People want to get down there. Uh Mudcat, thanks for being with us, man. I'm I'm glad we did this. Thanks, guys. And uh, Harold, good to see you. Former teammate with the Sweet and M's. Awesome. Hey, wait a minute. Before hey. you go, before you go, Harold had some video he wanted to show you. Yeah, this is all what right. Matt Swing looks like. No, no, no. <laughs> Not that. We want to see Mud, Mud's, uh, Mud's Seattle snap. My hey, snap? Trevor, oh, yeah. check this I out. just gave up a home run to Kevin Reimer. Watch, watch uh, look at Edgar right there. He's looking on the edge. Watch, he goes, oh, I'm out of here. <laughs> yeah. Good snap. Look at there's Val. Trevor, how great is that snap? <laughs> That's one of the best snaps ever. Look <laughs> at that walk. Hey, hey Trevor, Sarah. we've been hey, talking Sarah. about Matt <laughs> Swing. Can you imagine what Matt's baseball swing looks like after seeing this? <laughs> hey, how come I'm watching a tennis player right now? Don't sleep on the technique, by the way. It's just a drill. Don't sleep <laughs> on the technique. Look at the hand-eye coordination, Hoffy. What? You know, you know, they're in Melbourne right now, buddy. <laughs> you know, that scene right there, it reminds me of in Fletch, John Cocktoastman, when he's playing tennis with, uh, well, what's his name? Uh, Eric, uh, what's his name? His wife. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got to go. Oh, God. Uh, this is good stuff. Mutter, thank you, buddy. Hey, have fun at Fantasy hey, Camp, guys. Awesome, Great bro, seeing man. everybody you. down there. Talk to you guys Take soon. You the chicken. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's the weirdest thing I've ever seen. <laughs>